The purpose of this video is to give you an overview of how to use West key numbers in Westlaw Classic. Westlaw Classic uses key numbers as a part of their headnotes, which usually appear near the beginning of a case. Key numbers can be a great way to find cases that discuss a particular issue or area of law. To find key numbers in Westlaw, you would use the key numbers function located at the top of the screen. Key numbers will allow you to search for key numbers or browse the West key number digest outline. Using the search function, you can search across all of the topics and key numbers for cases on your topic. To search for key numbers on a topic, you first select which jurisdiction you would like to search. To do this, click on Change Jurisdiction, select a single or multiple jurisdictions, and click Done. Now you can enter your search terms. When picking search terms, it's best to stick with topical terms instead of specific facts. Let's try finding key numbers that discuss the elements of murder. We enter our terms, click search, and our results will appear. Generally after you run a search you will see related terms below the search bar that you can add to your search. If you selected multiple jurisdictions, your results will be organized based on those jurisdictions. If you select multiple key numbers and click on search selected, you will retrieve all of the cases that have been assigned those topics and key numbers. You can also click on a single topic and key number to retrieve only cases for that topic and key number. To narrow your list of cases by keywords, you can use Locate in Result, which is located on the left side of the screen. You can pull up a case from the list of results by clicking on the case name. Now let's look at how to find key numbers using the digest outline. You would first need to click on West Key Number Digest Outline. Using the digest outline, you can click on the plus signs to drill down into the outline until you get to the most relevant topic or topics. Once you have selected your topic or multiple topics, You would then click on Search Selected at the bottom of the screen. At the search screen you can select to order your results by either most recent cases or most cited cases, whether you want to include secondary sources, and which jurisdictions you want to search. It is also optional to narrow your list further with keywords using terms and connectors and date restriction. Once you have made your selections, then you would hit Search and all of the cases that meet those criteria would appear. If you wanted to further narrow your list of results by keywords, you could do so using Locate in Result on the left side of the screen. Now let's enter a case and look at the headnotes. You can locate the headnotes of a case just after the caption and the synopsis. Just like in print, all headnotes in Westlaw are made up of topics and key numbers. However, one thing that differs in the electronic format is that topics are also assigned a number. For example, in headnote number 1, the topic habeas corpus is assigned the number 197. Don't let this confuse you. The topic is still habeas corpus, and the key number is 205. The key number will always appear after the K in the last line of the topic and key number string. If you wanted to find other cases that have this same topic and key number, you would click on the hyperlinked topic and key number, select your search criteria, click search, and the results would be all of the cases that have the same topic and key number based on your search criteria. If you clicked on one of the hyperlinks in the subtopics above your key number, such as nature of remedy in general, you would broaden your search to a larger range of key numbers within that subtopic. You can retrieve the most cited cases in relation to your topic and key number by clicking on most cited cases. To jump down to the text in the case that corresponds to your headnote, click on the headnote number. You can jump to the corresponding headnote by clicking on the headnote number in the body of the case. That is it for your overview of how to use West Key Numbers and Headnotes in Westlaw Classic.